Namaskaram. Welcome to the traditional parenting series. In this video, I'll be sharing you a very simple method to burn zambrani without using charcoal or coconut shell. This is a very simple method which takes less than 2 minutes and can be done by anybody very easily. So for that, what you need is a zambrani stand like this. What I have here is a metal stand. It is available in mud also. The next thing is Samrani. Samrani, you can see it is in the form of chunks. Generally, we prefer to buy Samrani like this in the form of chunks and grind it into powder in the home just to make sure that the Samrani is pure. So, to do this, you can place the Samrani chunks in a polythene cover like this or you can uh, place it in a paper and grind it using a grinding pin like this. Just with gentle force, you can make it into powder. We need not grind it into a fine powder. It can be a bit coarser like this. After grinding it, you can transfer this powder into an airtight container for future use. So the next thing what we need is the coconut coir. So using this as a base, we are going to burn our samrani. So this coconut coir, I saved it from the coconuts which we bought for our kitchen and other puja purposes. And sometimes based on our requirement, we even get it from our nearby shops like vegetable shop or puja stores where they sell the coconuts. One beauty with this coconut coir is this can be saved up to a minimum of two years. Especially for the people living in the cities, if you get this coconut coir in bulk amounts from your native or some other place, you can definitely get it and store it for your future use. So these are the basic things which we need to burn the samrani. Now let us see how to burn samrani. First, as you can see, uh, you have to separate the coconut coir like this which facilitates it to catch fire easily so this coconut coir preparation uh, you can do it whenever you find time so when you want to burn samrani the process will be even more quick also one more important thing to take care of is the coconut coir should be completely dry otherwise when burned it may release smoke then place required amount of coconut coir in the samrani stand now light it with the matchstick and let it burn fully Wait until the flame is off. Once the flame is off, then put the samrani powder into it. And as you can see, samrani starts burning and smoke is coming out. And this smoke has got very beautiful smell which made our home atmosphere suddenly calm and pleasant. And there is a particular study which says that burning samrani in the home can kill the bacteria and certain viruses in the air and also on the surfaces. And burning samrani has always been a part of our tradition especially if there are small children or if somebody is unhealthy in the home. And it is always told that Samrani can purify the air. And the same thing the modern research is also accepting. Now, considering the situations we are in, it's the time to bring back our traditional practices. As it is always said, prevention is better than cure. So based on your need, you can keep adding the Samrani powder into the coconut coir. And you can place this in one corner in your home. Or you can take it around to all the rooms in your home like this. So based on how much time you want to burn the samrani, you can increase or decrease this coconut coir and add the samrani powder accordingly. As already mentioned, samrani is very much beneficial to babies, especially if newborn babies are exposed to samrani smoke immediately after giving them bath, it helps them in a great way. There is a particular way in which we prepare samrani smoke for the babies along with few other ingredients. So that procedure I have explained completely and clearly in a different video along with other benefits and other ways how we can make use of this samrani. So if you are interested you can go through that video. Link is available in the description box. So this is how we burn samrani in our home daily. So try to burn samrani regularly in your home as much as possible daily using this simple technique as it supports your health and well-being. Thank you for watching this video. Namaskaram.